Alright everyone, welcome back to Minecraft. I'm just uh, working on the storage bay a little bit more here, working on the flooring. Um, but, I thought we'd do something exciting starting off here once I'm done with this. We are going to name the horse, and I've already determined a name for the, the, for the guy. Remember the last episode how I was talking about, um, you know, my sister going to this one particular camp, uh, uh, horseback riding camp and whatnot? Well, he, there's a horse there. He doesn't exactly look like this guy, but I feel like the name here suits him. And I've determined that it's going to be a he. Get one of these. And you're wondering where my anvil went. But, um... Let's do this. Um, we're gonna name this guy. Belvedere. That's how you spell it? Yep, that's how you spell it. Sweet. Okay, we're gonna name the horse. Belvedere. There we are. <laughs> Sweet. The Mighty Belvedere. Yeah, that'll be a good name to... <laughs> episode title. <laughs> Lord Belvedere. <laughs> or Sire Belvedere, I don't know. Whatever the horse terminology is. <laughs> All these eggs, man. I can make some pretty good omelets with this. <laughs> I hope they didn't hear that. They probably did. Uh, but let's, let's see here, guys. Um, we're going to get started on the library here. Uh, which I'm excited for. Put, the, uh, bat, put that up. Do, 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 do. Don't be yawning on me, Belvedere. <laughs> so I've already uh, basically put a few blocks out for the, the walkway. If I remember correctly, it's... Like a chest goes here and a chest goes here. And it's a space here. And it wraps around like that. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Okay, so boink, boink. Boink, boink, boink. Okay. And then it's... I can't remember how many back it is, but we'll just go all the way back here. Um, I kind of want to fit five double chests this way. So, one, two, space. Let's do this. One, two, three, four, five. That would be good. Oops. <laughs> oh, about a minute in, I think. I nearly forgot to set my timer here. But I remembered. Now it's ain't working. Um. Yeah, lots of lots of good stuff going on. There we go. And then I think we're gonna need a little bit more wood here. Yeah, we can grab it from over here. Cause this one here here will probably be replaced with stone and shoot. Speaking of which need some more tools. I also need a new sword eventually. In fact, let's make one now. Let's see, we need that. And we need, let's see, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. That's for the shovels. Now, one, two, 
three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One. Okay. Now. There's that. Oops. And I made... I put in too, too many sticks. <laughs> That's okay. But yeah, we're we're building out the library. I'm gonna make sure there's room for an enchantment table because I am determined that we will find diamond eventually. I don't know how, but we will. And it, it and maybe through caving, it may be through one of the villagers. Either way, we're gonna have diamond. Um, there's no stopping that. Um, let's see here. I need some stone. Good old cobblestone. Just pick up some stuff like that. Let's do that. Shoot, you know what? I made this out oh, one block too many. That's okay, that's an easy fix relatively. But I want to find diamond eventually. And I don't know if I... Obviously, diamond lasts for... Apparently, there's a cave nearby. Oh, and there's the music. Uh, lovely music. Um, I don't know if I want to be swimming in diamond. Well, actually, I kind of would like to, like to have that. But... If that's not going to be the case, you know, that's fine. Yeah, I think, I think the enchantment table can go right in here. Right in this space here. That'll work. Huh. Oh, excuse me, guys. <laughs> Still a little tired. Long night of, uh, of working on stuff last night, um, art projects-wise. Um, got commissioned to do a piece recently. Uh, still need to talk payment with this person and negotiate all that. Um, but, uh, you know, I'm excited for, uh, for the gig. Um, should be very interesting. Let's do that. Just a block there. Um, boo, 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 boo. let me see here. Do I anything smelting at the moment? No. Um, I don't have very much coal. Well, you know what? We will fix that eventually. What I am going to do is I'm going to plant some trees. I'm thinking also, too, what we might do is begin to get our tree farm over at the storage bay going finally. Um, which will be nice. All these happy little trees. Happy, happy little trees. <laughs> For those of you that don't know that term, um, I don't know if anybody, you know, any of you watch PBS, um, but there used to be a guy on there. Unfortunately, he passed away several years back. But he's he was an artist by the name of Bob Ross. Awesome man. He and I actually share the same birthday. Um, you know he. He was a painter, um, oil painter to be exact. Um, he also, he, he was he, just an incredible artist. Hi, Creeper. Apparently I did not hear you come by and blow a hole in the earth.
hear one of those little baby zombies. Get out of here while I still can. Give these chickens something. Come on. There we go. Oh, there's that baby zombie. Get the sword on my bar. Oh, there's one in my head. There's one in my foot. <laughs> Darn arrows. Um, so far, not much of a difference between the uh, the easy normal difficulty, but it's nice. But as I was saying, Bob Ross, incredible painter, incredible artist. Um, he died. How long ago? Um, but it was a very sudden loss. He died at the age of like 51 or 2 or something like that, maybe a little older. I can't remember. But it was due to cancer. And the assumption is that he passed away. Um, it, it, you know, it's, it's the assumption is that the cancer that he had was because of all the paint fumes. Um, which is a logical, logical statement. You know what we're going to do? We're going to put a chest right down here. Yeah, let's do that. Um, but, uh, one of the awesome sayings that he would have is, uh, this term, because he painted a lot of nature uh, uh, drawings, or not drawings, he painted a lot of nature paintings and all that kind of stuff, mountainscapes, landscapes. He put a little, you know, he put some architectural designs in there as well amongst them, but the, the landscape would be the main feature. And um, whenever he'd put trees in there, he, you know, used the term happy little trees. Which just, you know, cracked me up because it was so amazing, you know, to have this guy really have kind of just a childlike, fun quality to, uh, not only to life, but also his work. So, and he, he's one of those artists that really genuinely loved what he did and, you know, did it well, um, you know, and he was on... He was on the show, and I can't remember the title of it, but he was on the show um, for quite a few years, actually. I can't remember how long it ran. I think they show reruns of it every so often. But uh, a lot of people will also refer to Bob Ross as the, the Afro guy because he had a nice, nice Afro Um yeah, but he he was inspired to do landscapes after he um, was doing um, deployment in Alaska f uh, for <clears throat> for the Navy. Sorry, my voice is a little croaky. Let me get some water before the next episode. Oh, I think I have a little. No, I don't have any in my glass. Shoot. That's okay. Um, but uh, he was he was stationed in Alaska for the Navy. Um, and uh, that's one of you know that's one of the, the places that got him inspired to uh, to paint and stuff like that. No, well, I mean he had been you know doing painting off and on you know, and whatnot, but, uh, basically, his, his time in, in the Navy, um, especially on his off days, allowed him to really see nature, and all that kind of stuff, 
Um, you know, which which is incredible. Um, but seriously, just you know, <laughs> look him up. He's a fun guy. Um, uh, you know, just you know, doing what he loves, painting. <laughs> but um, let's see here. I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't. I know what I'm doing now. Here's what I need. Actually, you know what? Let me do this. I need some more coal, though. Shoot. Shoot, shoot. We're going to have to get that at some point. Well, I'll sm smelt up 16 pieces of that for now. You know what we're going to do? You guys didn't think I was going to do this. We're going to do a little caving. Because <laughs> we need some more resources. Um, Do I want to go down here? We kind of explored already down here. Let's go to... Let's go to... Excuse me. Let's go to a different area. Let me see if I can find a different area here. Because all over the place, it's just littered with, with little holes and stuff like that. So... I don't have to go too far to uh, to find something amazing. Oh, whoa, whoa! What is that? All oh, that I hadn't noticed before. Let's check this out. little exploratory stuff. This is... Wow. Oh my gosh. This is going in my screenshot. Save. One. Wow. That is amazing. Look at... Just look at that. And there's probably a ton of resources in there. Just in this mound that we can use. But I almost, I almost don't want to touch it because it's, it's so stunning. I've never seen that before. That is amazing. Um, let's go this way. I mean, this is interesting to have flat planes and all of a sudden, boom, right here. I want to see what's over here. Because this, this is incredible. I mean, I, that is way up there. And one day I'm going to get to the top of that. And it's just... Wow. There's those ugly trees I, I hate so much. But I mean, this... I'll, I'll, give, I'll give the person... You know, I'll give you know, the creator's credit to this. This works well with this. I will say that. I will admit that. Ooh, what have we got over here? Another cave down here. Excellent. And I saw something back over the distance over there. What have we got over there? I'll explore this in a second. Um, what have we got over here? Sunflowers. Awesome. What the heck have we got over here? This is amazing. Uh, and unfortunately, I can't explore too much because I got five left, five minutes left on the episode, roughly. But wow! Oh, I'm gonna be exploring this area a lot. And there's coal over here. I'll I'll get some of this coal over here first. Woo. Wow! This this is beautiful. This is. I, I'm in awe. I really... I, wow. Oh, amazing. Amazing landscape. I, I, I have new... I, I mean, I already love this map. Just from the fact alone that there's two villages right near spawn. 
But now I love it even more because just this, this is amazing. Um, it's amazing landscape. I almost kind of don't want to touch it though because it's so, it's so amazing. Um, is that, is that the music I hear? A little bit of music I hear. Yes, there it is. I think I, you know, I. I don't want to mess with my levels, but I may turn the music up if you guys want. Just, just let me know. Um. Wow, this is amazing. All right, well, I'm gonna get this this last piece here. And then I'm going to head back over to this area here. With the last few minutes, we're going to explore a little bit of this cave over here. Or the, I don't know if it's a cave. But it's something. Um, where is it? Where is it? Yeah, I got maybe like three minutes. <laughs> I'm being good this time. I'm being... I'm not recording as long of episodes. Um, that's some glitched out water. Oh, iron right off the bat. Excellent. Coal. Cool. Oh, skeleton. That's dangerous. Cool. Shoot, more skeletons. You didn't think I had that skill, did you? <laughs> oh, man. Already some good resources right off the bat, guys. This is awesome. Caves, I don't mind wrecking. We're gonna need more torches. Um. More stuff behind here. Cool. <sighs> Naturally, I don't have any sticks. Well, I guess this is about as far as we're going to go. <laughs> Get some of this. Some of the gravel here. Because, you know, we, we need that flint. Get some more of this coal. Like I said before, lots of pockets of, uh, plenty of pockets of um, awesomeness here. But yeah, let me just get some of this coal here. And I think we're going to end the episode here, guys. Let me just, you know, getting some resources here. Um, you know, this is, this is fun. I mean, I, and, you know, I already have close to 100 views on my channel. Um, you know, I, you know, I only have two subscribers at this point, but, you know, that's okay. Two is better than nine. <clears throat> Excuse me. Lost the pick. <laughs> um, but I, I just thank you for you know all the love and support because you know that it means a lot that you know you check out the stuff. Um, you know, and uh, yeah, because it's just amazing. You know, oh, it's nighttime. Do I brave it? Let's do this. Breakthrough. Let's go. I remember our house is straight this way, so. Let's go, let's go. Yay. Yay. Peg was interested in those carrots. That's one thing we'll get to as a pig farm. 
may not be now, but we will get it. There's the thing in the distance there. Oh, don't look at the Enderman. Is that be bad? Almost there, almost there, wasn't we're almost there. <sighs> Breathing. <laughs> Bedtime. <laughs> Alright guys, well that I think I'm gonna stop the episode here. Thank you all for watching. Um and again thanks for all the love and support. Leave a like on the video if you liked it, a comment if you want to as well. And don't as always forget to hit that subscribe button, show all the love. Um Hi Skeleton. <laughs> Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.